We're looking at another level 2 functional skills exam question and this one's uh, it's a bit of a beast. You've got this part of the question which is 5 marks which is a lot for a functional skills question and then on top of that you've also got a, a check of your working and you've got this big scary table and all of this, this big paragraph of, of words that you need to understand to answer the question. So let's slowly go through and pick out the information we need. Alice wants to use solar panels on her roof to produce electricity. Each solar panel can produce a maximum of 200 watts. Alice knows the direction of her roof faces south 70 degrees west. The slope of her roof is 40%. Now this information here that I just read through, these two lines, uh, these bits, they tell us about uh, this chart. So I can find her house on this chart somewhere. So if her roof faces 70, sorry, south 70 degrees west, south 70 degrees west is this column here and it says the slope of her roof is 40%. So if I, if I go down to 40%, this box here is her. So let me choose a different colour so that's a bit easier to see. There. Oh, now I've gone over the lines. <sighs> Sorry. Pen. Here. This is her. Right. So her, with, her, with the slope of her roof and the way it's facing, her solar panels will be at 84% efficiency. So let's carry on reading through the question. She uses this chart to find the percentage of the maximum number of watts that can be produced by a solar panel on her roof. Alice wants the solar panels to produce at least 3 kilowatts. She knows that 1 kilowatt is 1000 watts. She thinks she will need 16 solar panels. Is Alice correct? Right. So for this question, we need to work out how much power 16 solar panels will produce if each solar panel generates 200 watts but is only at 84% uh, efficiency. So first of all, 16 solar panels, 200 watts, uh, 16 times 200, that's how many watts all these solar panels could produce. So let's come over to our calculator. 16 solar panels, 200 watts each, so altogether that's 3,200 watts add up to the working out box. But like I said, this is if they were at 100%. This is if they were using, if they were making all the watts they could. But with her roof, they're only making 84% of the watts that they could make. So we need to find 84% of 3,200. Now there are different ways of doing percentages. So if you have a way that you like that I'm not going to talk about, that's absolutely fine. Do it your way if you're comfortable with it and if it works and gets the same answer. But the way I like to do percentages is to take my, my big number, which is going to be 3,200. I like to divide by 100, and whatever my answer is, that will be 1%. And then multiply that by what percent I need. But let's do it one step at a time. 1% is going to be 3,200 divided by 100. So if they were at just 1% efficiency, they would make 32 watts. Her 16 solar panels all together would just make 32 watts. Uh, and let's copy that to our working out box to get some marks. So that's our 1%, but they're not at just 1%. That would be mental. You wouldn't bother. Uh, it's not 1%, it's 84%. So I need to take my 1%, which is 32, and I need 84 times as much. I'm getting the 84 from the table here. They're making 84% of the watts they could. Uh, so 1% times 84, because I need 84%, gives me 2,688 watts. Copy to working out box. So her, if she thinks she needs 16 solar panels, those 16 solar panels could produce 3,200 watts, but because they're only 84% efficiency, um, they, they only end up making 2,688 watts. Okay. She wants the solar panels to produce at least 3 kilowatts. Is this at least 3 kilowatts? That's the something we need to work out. She knows that 1 kilowatt is 1,000 watts. So if I can work out how many thousands I have in here, that's how many kilowatts I have in here. So if I want to know how many thousands go into something, I take that number, 2688, and divide it by a thousand. And when I press equals, this answer is how many thousands, and therefore how many kilowatts, are in this many watts. Equals. Okay. So her solar panels are going to be producing 2.2. 688 kilowatts. Alice wants the solar panels to produce at least 3 kilowatts. 
she thinks she'll need 16 and this is all we've been doing we've been doing the maths with 16 solar panels is Alice correct no her solar panels are only going to gener generate 2.68 kilowatts uh, I could even put that here kilowatts and she needs 3 kilowatts so is she correct no she is not show a check of your working in my working out box I'm going to give myself a separate space to do a check um, and I'm going to pick one of the things I did up earlier in the question and do a reverse calculation uh, it doesn't matter which pit bit I choose I'm going to choose the first thing I did now when I say reverse calculation I'm going to start with my answer from this just this little section which was 3200 uh, actually I'll do it on the calculator 3200 and it's a reverse calculation so instead of doing a times I'm going to be doing a divide so 3200 divided by one of these two things and my answer should be the other one so if I pick uh, 16 then if I've done this bit of the calculation right my answer when I press equals should be 200 but I don't know that I've got it right yet this is why it's a check so I can't just assume it's going to be 200 I can't write it down without doing it on the calculator because then I'm not checking you know you might have made a mistake somewhere so 3200 divided by 16 should be 200 and is it yes it is so I've just checked that I did this bit of my working out correct so we've got that one mark for checking our answer to go through these five marks we worked out how much they could produce if they were at maximum efficiency we found our 84 percent of it after reading that from the graph we then converted it from watts if I put a W there for watts converted it from watts into kilowatts and determined whether this 16 solar panels that we were working with was enough for 3 kilowatts which it was not so there we go that's what you needed to do for 6 marks on this big beast of a question